I got home from Santa Barbara today. <laughs> We're making cauliflower pizza. Got it from Trader Joe's. We're... Did you show them the box? Yeah. We're gonna put chicken pesto on one. We're gonna probably just do pepperoni on the other, right? Yeah. Or just cheese. Whatever you guys wanna do. So I have pepperoni. Have pepperoni, yeah, I agree. <laughs> That was really good. Like, I seriously recommend it. That tasted 10 out of 10. I actually, I'm like the pickiest eater in the world. I hate all vegetables. I hate everything. And I couldn't tell that it was cauliflower except the texture. Thoughts? Concerns? Questions? Love it. So 10 good. out of 10. Yeah! I thought I was supposed to go! No. I told you! You didn't live! Wait, okay, wait, wait, wait. 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 This was supposed to be on the top, and somehow protects it. Ow! I no, no! Her. Bella! I wait, is that gonna get stuck? <laughs> Why does this look so gross on camera? Oh, Guys, we made chicken pesto wow. pizza wait, 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 wait. cauliflower <laughs> base. Ooh, the chicken tastes really good. <laughs> I know, I made it worse. I made All right, it. let's cut this. Oh, Why does it look like I'm in a collared shirt? I'm in a hoodie. <laughs> so I just got back from um, a workout class and now I'm gonna make breakfast. And you guys always ask me to do like what I eat in a day type of video. But since I'm vlogging, I just thought I could show you like um, what I eat in a day vlog style, I guess. I don't know. Um, usually for breakfast I have scrambled eggs because it's really, really good for you. Before I worked out, I had a banana because I can't work out with having like without having something in my body, like a little bit of food. So I usually have a banana before I work out. Um, but yeah, this is my breakfast. I just got out of the shower and I'm, I just threw on this little summer dress. It's literally like 85 degrees out, maybe hotter. So this little dress is actually from Lulu's, but it's like the brand is Billabong. Um, it's really cute, I like it a lot. I wasn't gonna wash my hair because obviously it was just dry, but it just like, I felt so gross since I worked out, but I wanted to like style it since I wanted to film, um, but I couldn't. <laughs> Cause I like really couldn't stand it. It just felt so gross, like, you know what I mean. Um, but I'm, um, where's my computer? Oh, I just stepped on it. I think I'm gonna upload the what's in my purse video right now. I'm like a little bit hesitant to do so because let me tell the vlog so even though this video will be up after obviously since I'm uploading this one right now but the reason I'm a little bit hesitant to upload it is because not that I have a nice purse in it because my purse as you guys know if you watched it was a Gucci bag and I not that I have anything weird in my purse that I wouldn't want people to see just because I kept it really real I just like didn't really um, take anything out of it but um, the reason I don't want to upload it is because I watch it over and I feel like I sound just really vain in it, if that makes any sense. Like, I just sound, I don't know. I think a lot of people have been telling me lately, like, on my videos, and I shouldn't ever let, like, comments or hate comments get to me, but that I'm, like, not as humble as I used to be and I'm more vain and whatever. And I think it just stems because I feel more confident in my channel so I can just be myself more and not, like, so shy and, like, ready to please everyone. I'm just more myself. But I don't want people to think I'm vain because I'm not vain. I know I'm not vain, I know I'm, I try to be humble, I don't think I'm the shit, so, I don't know, this video just, I feel like, makes me seem vain. <laughs> um, I think I'm looking into it a lot because that's what I get in the comments a lot, but I hope no one, at least, the, I don't care about the haters, 
um, that think I'm vain, but if my subscribers start to think I'm vain, that's an issue. So I love you guys so much. I'm always so grateful for you. I never want any, like anything to come off that way. I, I'm so humbled to do what I do, and I'm so blessed and lucky that over 800,000 people like want to come on this journey with me. So I really hope I make that clear. Um, and if I don't, then it's just my 17-year-old self getting to my head seriously. But I think I'm gonna upload it, so let's do it. <laughs> um, you might have seen in my Instagram story yesterday, if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, it's always linked down below, but I'll have my socials like right here. Because <laughs> um, I post so much and I update you guys and it's like the best place to follow me if you just want like daily updates. Um, but I got a bunch of stuff from Fresh, so this was not sent to me, I bought this with my own money, so I was thinking about doing a skincare haul. Um, I've never, I've used some of the products, but I've never used all of them. I bought a lot of new things, and I kind of wanted to switch up my skincare, even though I'm obsessed with Lancer, but I'm out of the products. And, I don't know, I just wanted to try something new, and, but I'll probably buy more, because you guys know that's like my ride or die skincare. Um, but yeah, so... I think I'm going to film a haul on this. My hair is still a little damp. Um, I need to dry it and then maybe style it a little bit before I film. I actually want to head downstairs, though, and make myself a little snack before I start filming and doing my hair and stuff just because it helps with energy, obviously, when I'm filming. Um, do you hear when I walk, my ankles crack? Oh, I hate it. I normally just cut this up. Now we take it upstairs. Actually, I'm not allowed to eat in my room, but I hope my parents don't watch this, but if they do watch this, the reason I eat in my room is I don't make a mess. And because when I'm in the kitchen and I eat, I rush eat because I want to get back to my room. And then I make myself full and I feel sick and I, and I binge eat also when I'm in my kitchen. Like I don't stop eating if I'm just down there because I eat so fast, I still think I'm hungry. So when I bring my snack up to my room, I just sit down, I watch videos, I enjoy myself, and I don't feel like I need to rush anything because I'm just content in my bed. So that's a trick. That's my little trick for me if you binge eat like me. I actually binge eat. I'm not just like claiming like I will eat and won't stop. So it's a really good way. It's how I lost a lot of weight by doing this actually. I mean, I lost most of my weight from eating healthy and working out, but it's a good tip. Excuse the, <laughs> the noise, my dog is eating her lunch. But usually for lunch, I like to make myself something not super heavy, especially if I'm going out after this because I hate feeling like overly full. Um, so I usually make myself like a little turkey wrap. It's one of my favorite snacks. It's so yummy and just easy and it's not that I, I don't really, I'm not the type of person when I'm eating healthy or like trying to stay fit to count calories. I just like put healthy foods in my body and eat until I'm full, which I think is important. I think once you start counting calories, you go a little bit nuts, but I know that this is pretty low calorie. So I usually like having some corn tortillas. I prefer corn over flour, but if you prefer flour, that's totally fine. I usually just do like two of them, they're little. And then I'll just heat them in the microwave for like 30 seconds. And then I just get like some sliced turkey from the market. Um, I just get it at like the deli section. And I just have them really thinly, I think it's called oven gold, boar's head oven gold is the type of turkey I get. And I just have them slice it super, super thin. So 30 seconds. Um, I just have them slice it really thin and then I just put some of that in the tortilla and I have that for lunch and it's so good. It doesn't make me super full, but I usually have like fruit or something else with it. So I'm trying to figure out what, I might have like chips, I don't know, <laughs> we'll see. So I look like I'm eating like a five year old and basically two. Um, I just have turkey wraps and then like some veggie chips and these little cheesy popcorn things from Trader Joe's. They're a little bit better than Pirate's Booty. I think they're the same thing, but you gotta treat yourself, okay? And I'm 17 and I have to live a little bit. So, 
That's my lunch. I know I'm five. Don't judge me. I genuinely have no idea if my camera's in focus. I'm really hoping it is. I'm just about to go shopping with my sister. So I'm just putting my sneakers on. They said they were just getting salad really quickly, like 45 years ago. Just been waiting at home. Um, I haven't filmed the video that I was wanting to film today. Time just honestly kind of slipped away, um, but that's okay. I posted today and I'll probably film it tomorrow. Um, no big deal. Just putting my sneakers on and I'll show you guys a little outfit shot. These jeans are from a brand called Storettes. I'll put it on the screen right here. It's just store and then TS. Um, I actually got them from a showroom. They were gifted to me. But I like want to go on and order 100 more. I'm so obsessed with them. And then this little crop shirt is from Zara. It doesn't come cropped. I literally just took scissors in my kitchen and cut it. And then I'm wearing my little Gucci sneakers. And these sneakers are my favorite because they have this little thing on them. And I got these for Christmas. And then this side's red and that side's blue. And then, yeah, so. That's, that's basically the look. <laughs> I got hungry. <laughs> I'm eating Matt's munchies. You can get these at Whole Foods, I think, or on Amazon, like food, whatever it is. They're so good. Update, I'm snacking on these. It's been like two seconds since I last saw you, but they're so good. Where's my outfit, if anyone was wondering? I can't turn it off. Oh, chins, that's from those Pirate Puffs. <laughs> We made our dad oatmeal raisin cookies because they're his favorite in tomorrow's Father's Day. So we're just waiting for them to cook a little bit um, longer. I think they're just about done, maybe like 30 more seconds, but they look so good. Ooh, those look so good. I'm probably making everybody watching this want cookies right now because anytime I watch the YouTuber put food in their vlog or if they're eating or something, I always want the food. But. They look really good. They're still like super soft. We just took them out a little bit early since tomorrow is Father's Day. I completely forgot to end the vlog, of course. Um, basically, after we baked those cookies, we just... What happened? I don't even know. We just kind of had a chill night. And then, obviously, yesterday was Father's Day. We went to Orange County. I saw my grandparents and my cousins and my aunts and stuff. And now I'm back home. It's Monday, June 19th. I'm going to upload this today. But I just wanted to give like some sort of outro since I totally forgot to end the vlog. And I also just wanted to say like I'm sorry since this was such like a weird random chatty vlog. I kind of just liked how casual it was though. It was like a fun way to catch up with you guys. To give you guys a little sneak peek into my life. Mel is coming over today so I'm probably going to start a new vlog. Because we go to VidCon on Wednesday and I definitely want to vlog that. And I definitely want to vlog when she's here before. So I'm going to end this one now and then basically start another one. But down in the description box I am going to have all my VidCon times and panels or if I'm doing meetups. I don't really know my schedule. I think I'm doing one panel. Maybe two? I think one. So I'm going to link it down or just write it down below if you guys are at VidCon. It would mean so much to me if you went to my panel and said, hey, I want to meet you guys so badly. I love meeting you. So yeah, thanks for watching this vlog and... Hopefully I will see you at VidCon, but if not, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!